guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for joining me once again i really appreciate you guys joining me each and every week uh and i hope that we'll have more subscribers on board um thank you so much thank you thank you thank you i really really appreciate it so today we have, we have uh today we have a styling uh video uh normally when i go on youtube i look i look for you know work inspiration like work like professional professional not 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 the casual work um workwear but the professional um uh, so normally sometimes when i watch youtube i like finding inspiration and use things that i already have in my wardrobe um and uh you know try and reuse whatever it is that i'm wearing to work and you know change things around same things change things around and uh make sure that you're not buying too much you know make sure that you're not buying too many things uh when you actually do not need them you just need to change things around so i decided to do a fashion video with regards to if you work in a very professional environment i work in a professional environment um so there, there are certain things that you wear to work and certain things that you don't wear to work so for for my work environment it's 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 the professional professional environment and um and um yeah so certain things that you wear certain, certain things that you don't wear so I thought that it would be nice to bring in just a touch to this um, and uh, have some vintage inspired workwear. Um, yeah, vintage inspired workwear video. So for this, my inspiration was from Pinterest. I looked at some pictures that were, that were there on Pinterest um, from the 60s, you know, fashion from the 60s, from the 70s, from the 80s. And I tried to just look through the things that I already have in my wardrobe uh, and see if I can actually, you know, rejuge the way I would wear them just to have a different look and feel to, to, yeah, to my, to my, to my professional attire. So what I'll do in, within this video, I'll prop, I'll show you an outfit plus the inspiration, and then I'll just talk you through a few things. Uh, but let me just be, let me just say three things before we even start. Uh, for starters, I am a very simple person. So simple makeup, um, simple hair, um, simple accessories. Like for this video, I'll just be wearing the same accessories. Uh, I will link everything in the description below, or, or probably the things that I mentioned. And uh, for shoes, I'll just be interchanging three pairs of shoes. Um, I got these shoes from Woolworths, they were on sale. So if, if I'm wearing something and, 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 and I can remember where I, where I got it, I will, I will just mention it and uh, try and you know, just put the names in the description below. So this is the first outfit. Uh, as you can see, it's a shift dress. If you look at the picture, you can see that from, from the picture, it's, it's a really short, it's a really short dress, but at least uh, the puff sleeves are there. I thought it would be nice. The puff sleeves are there. And then, um, and then now for me, given that this is, this is above the knees. I normally like to wear, you know, some uh, pantyhose. Um, I feel like that just gives a different touch to to the outfit, and then you don't feel a bit uncomfortable when you're moving around a lot. So I actually like uh, this look. This this dress is from Woolworths. I got it when it was on sale. Um, the for the for the pantyhose, I think you can you, you, you can get some pantyhose from Bata. They also have the same the same. These ones uh, I got them as a gift. I just got like many as a gift, and uh, those are the ones that I normally just just use. And as you can see, my pantyhose are a bit thick. I actually like the thick ones, especially right now when it's cold, so that you don't feel uncomfortable during the day. Then now when it becomes a bit sunny and it's a bit lighter, then I'll wear the then I'll wear the sheer the more sheer one. So if I'm not mistaken, this is a 60, yeah, this is a 60 den, um, but when it's warmer, I like to wear 40, 20 den. Um, then the shoes that I'm wearing are from Woolworths. Um, they're just, uh, I also got them in sa on, on sale. Um, yeah, so I think some of these uh, things you can, you know, just look out to, just look out as to when these places have sales. So this is my first outfit. What do you guys think? Did I nail it? Did I not nail it? Uh, just let me know and uh, give me styling tips below. I would appreciate. Um, so this is the second outfit. And if you look at the picture, the concept is fit and flair. So in as much as I might not have all the, 
if all the things that that other dress had I thought that it would be nice to just bring on you know to just try on a fit and flare dress so this is something that I this is a dress from Mr. Price I bought it a long long time ago um, it has the fit and flare style and uh, I think it's actually very flattering if you look at it it's very flattering uh, if I'm to turn around so that you can see the back this is the back very flattering as well uh, I paired it with the same accessories that I was wearing uh, uh, the, uh, the, for the for the first outfit then I also paired it with uh, the same pantyhose and now for the shoes I looked for a doll type of shoe the same shoe that I bought from Woolworths also um, it has a small heel they're not pumps but they have a small heel and um, and yeah I actually really like this this outfit a lot and the good thing about this outfit is when when you're feeling cold it looks really good with a scarf really nice with a scarf uh, and then now you can wear with a cardigan on top and given that it's long sleeve you'll be a bit warm yeah so this is my second outfit and let's go on to the third outfit but before we go there did I nail it did I um, or am I too far off from what the picture shows? So this is the third outfit. And if you can see from the picture, the picture has two people. Uh, but I chose the lady in the skirt. Though her skirt is a bit colorful, my color palettes are not so, so, so vibrant like that. So I thought it would be good for, you know, for me to try out the skirt. You'd be surprised where I got the skirt. I got the skirt from Bossini. They had a sale. And this is actually a skirt for small children, <laughs> but it fits me perfectly. Um, I like the look of it. Then uh, I paired it with a with a shirt with a tie. This is a sleeveless shirt. That's why I'm wearing a, a cardigan. And then maybe now we're in the office and you're and you're too hot, then you can remove the cardigan. But um, now I also paired it with a purple cardigan, and I feel like the colors the colors they actually go well together. And then um, I used the, the same shoes, um, the doll shoes, and also the same pantyhose because it's a bit short so that at least I feel comfortable in the office. Um, yeah, so what do you think about this outfit? Did I nail it? I know in the picture the lady has a shirt, but um, I wanted to go, I, I just wanted to zhuzh it up a little bit, with, at least with something that I, can, that I can actually wear and something that I already had in my wardrobe. So what are your thoughts with uh, with regards to this? Did I nail it? Was it a hit or a miss? Uh, let me know in the comment section below. So this is my next outfit. This I think is the fourth outfit. Um, I really loved the picture. Just the inspiration with regards to the picture. And uh, I normally actually do this style. Just, you know, when, it, when it's actually very cold, you just wear a turtleneck inside. And I feel like turtlenecks are very, very, very flattering on all um on all people and um also the other fact is that i mean they're they're really 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 warm and then i feel like also such a dress it's normally a work dress that uh most women have in their closets this is such a, a flattering dress for all body types um normally every time i wear this someone actually compliments me in the office um i actually really 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 like this pairing um so, so as we can see, this is a uh, sort of like a shift dress, uh, and then uh, this is a turtleneck. Then I've paired it with the same um, uh, pantyhose, given that it's a bit short, and also now the heels, the heels that I wore with the first with the first shift dress that I um, that I actually wore. So if I'm to turn around, this is how it looks like. I think. I think this is a really, 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 really nice look. I just maintain the same accessories I had, the same hair. Um, and yeah, what are your thoughts? Did I, did I nail it with reference to the picture? Um, yeah, kindly comment below and let me know. So this is my next outfit. I, I tried to maintain the colors that we can see from the, from the picture. I loved how uh, that, looked, that, that look made, um, made that lady, you know, uh, yeah, like I, I, I love that look on that lady. So I thought I should try it. I've, I've never tried it uh, like this before using a dress like this with a with a v-neck and a, and a bow. So I thought I should just try it and see how it looks like. 
So I've paired this with a, with a dress that is sort of um, airline. Uh, I think it's also, it's also flattering for most body types. Um, and then uh, I've also paired it with, with a shirt. This is, uh, this is a, a sort of striped shirt. Um, same, same pantyhose because it's a bit short as we can see the length of this dress. Uh, same accessories and I've decided to go lower with the shoes. So these shoes um, are, the, are the sort of um, doll shoes with like a small heel. So yeah, uh, what are your thoughts? If I'm to turn around, this is how it looks like if I'm to turn around. Um, let me know what you guys think. Did I nail it? Does it suit me? Because to be honest, out of all the outfits I've tried so far, this is not really my, my favorite. Yeah, like it's, yeah, it's, it's really not my favorite. I, I feel like this shirt would go better on, um, on, um, on a round neck dress so that the collar just pops out without the, without the, you know, too much detail. Cause I feel like there's the bow here, there's the shirt there. I, I lot, there's a lot happening here. So I, I'm not really feeling confident with this, but, uh, let me know in the comment section below. What are your thoughts? What do you guys think? Um, yeah, let's move on to the next dress. This is the next outfit and um, and as you can see from the picture, they had a bit more vibrant colors, um, but uh, in my wardrobe I didn't have that. So I just stuck to things that are of the same color, color palette and see how that flows. And also from the picture you can see that they didn't put a shirt, but for me I've put a shirt on because I feel like at times when you're in the office, when you leave the house, maybe it's cold, but when in the office, you want to remove your sweater. And this will allow me to do that because I have a shirt inside. So I've paired this with a, with a brown jersey. And this is, a, this is, these are brown pants. And I've also paired them with some, uh, with some pumps from, from Woolworths. I also got these when they were also on sale. Um, I... Someone might think that I should wear heels with this, but I, 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 I feel more comfortable with flats when I'm wearing this. Um, I actually, maybe it's, because of the, maybe it's because of the length of the trousers, but I actually feel more comfortable like this. Um, well, initially, I had actually tucked this in, but I didn't like how it looked. It was looking a bit, it was looking a bit funny on the waistline, so I decided to, to, to just let the, to let the jersey out. This is a jersey that I got from the price and I got it a while ago. Um, I actually really like because it's actually very warm. At times, say when it's really cold, I just wear this and put a jacket on top and wait to the office. Then I remove the, the, the outer jacket and I just uh, spend my day with the jersey. But I actually really like it so far. So if I'm to just take a twirl around, you'll be able to see how that looks like. Yeah, so that's the front and that's the back of the outfit. Um, if I'm to rate this outfit with regards to the other outfits I wore, I would rate uh, a bit low. A bit low. Maybe if I maybe if I had styled it the way it was styled on the on 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 uh, on uh, on the model, then I think maybe I'd like it a bit more. But as it is right now, yes, it's okay. Yes, it's something I would wear, but it doesn't look as sharp as as that other outfit looked. Yeah. So what are your thoughts on this outfit? Kindly comment on the comment section below. Was it a hit? Was it a miss? Uh, please let me know. So this is the next outfit. I really like the way it looks on the vintage model. It looks so leisurely. It looks so playful. Um, so I decided to just try and see what I have in my wardrobe and see if I can emulate that. Uh, I, I tried. <laughs> I tried given that the, you can see that from the model it looks a bit more leisurely it's not really work 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 wear but from the way I put it together this is work appropriate um, I've, 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 uh, I've tried to still maintain the loose fit of the of the shirt um, given that this shirt is very low cut I had to put a spaghetti top underneath so that it doesn't look inappropriate for work um, I just chose the white one given that the color the most prominent color palette for for the top is actually white then i've paired it with um with some uh navy pants uh and uh some heels as well 
so that at least uh, it looks a bit put together for the office. Um, if I'm to turn around, let me just show you. Yeah, so that's how it looks like when you turn around. I, I actually really like this outfit. This is something that um, I can, yeah, this is something that I can actually feel comfortable going to work in, uh, but not when it's cold. Now, if, if it's cold, you need something a bit warmer, but when, 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 when it's a bit warm, this is a, this is a lovely, this is a lovely combination and I really like it. Uh, what are your thoughts on this? Did I nail it? Uh, was it a hit or a miss? Uh, kindly let me know in the comments below. Oh wow, I really love this outfit. So my inspiration with this was for casual Friday. Some offices that have casual Friday, they don't have to look all the way formal on Fridays. So for casual Friday, uh, I thought this would look so nice. It would look so, 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 so cute. Um, if I'm to compare it to the pictures that are there, you see that there's a there's one from 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 all the ladies that are wearing some of the clothes there. You can see that there's one who has a, a dress that almost emulates this one. Um, I love this dress. It has pockets. I put a belt so that it can cinch in at least the waist bit. Otherwise, it's going to look a bit lo loose because it has that um, it, it has the the loose uh feel um uh, if i'm to turn around let me just turn around so that you see uh, how i paired it i just decided to just make it very simple so i paired it with just some pumps uh some brown pumps um uh, at least with the with this brown belt that matches i think well with the with the brown buttons as well um this is a navy dress i think it looks really really cute and you can even wear it maybe on the weekend or something um it's honestly speaking i love this dress i really really love it and it's free um you're not confined you're not constricted in any way um yeah i love it so on to the next one and that will be our last uh, outfit this is the next outfit so for this one it's not really inspired by pinterest um the reason why i wore it is because it's the time i wore it to work right and there's a guy who actually complimented me and he's like today you're looking like those people from 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 a long time ago i was like really what do you mean and he's like you're dressed like those people who used to work on the on on the phones when you know during that long time ago honestly speaking i like this outfit uh i've been watching cable girls and it sort of, sort of, sort of looks like it's around that era. I really love this outfit. It is the, um, this top I got it from H&M. Uh, this pencil skirt I got it from Woolworths. I've just paired it with this pencil skirt. I feel like these are good uh, color, color combinations. Then I just uh, paired it with a, with, a, with a light jersey. This is a sleeveless top, so you can't really, like for me, I don't feel comfortable really wearing it alone unless it maybe I'm at my desk. Um, and then uh, this is just a this is just a jersey, which I'm sure you can find um, you know just a just a just a just a nice cardigan that you can put on top. Uh, if I'm to turn around, this is how it looks like. Can you see how here at the back, it does not have that slit. I really love it. It doesn't. I feel like. I feel like this is a, a well-made skirt. It's midi length. I know midi length is not for everyone. Um, I love midi length. Like, I don't mind it. I love long dresses. I love, you know, midi length things. I love knee length, uh, short things to some extent. Um, yeah, so I actually really love this, love this combination. I'm sure if you go to work like this, it looks like you're really... You know like you mean business on that day like which meeting are you going to yeah so i think this marks the end of our um of our video thank you so much for listening thank you so much for watching um i really appreciate please feel free to engage with me comment down below let's have conversations um i like speaking to you guys so yeah thank you thank you so much for watching um
Yeah, have a lovely, lovely week.